Cheryl Bailey and welcome to this Bebop Blues Etudes edition of Essentials. I've prepared 10 Bebop Blues soloing performance studies that focus on the technical and harmonic skills that all of our favorite Bebop guitar players use in their own solos and improvisations. We'll concentrate on the use of core tones as the focal point of the melodic line to avoid being stuck in the blues scale box. Along the way, we'll also work on concepts and techniques like placing and displacing rhythms, chord extensions, chord soloing, modern chord substitutions, playing over minor two fives, applying the dominant seven bebop scale, and chromatic melodic embellishments. These 10 studies cover a range of blues song forms and a variety of tempos, keys, and grooves. For example, we'll start off with a 12-8 shuffle in the key of G that uses drop two chords to harmonize the melody. Then, we'll work on a Jimmy Smith-style shuffle that uses arpeggios to create melodic lines. We'll use chromatic melodic embellishments and displaced rhythmic phrases. We'll explore some minor two fives using the diminished seven to hippify the dominant. We'll explore a funky Herbie Hancock style approach for soloing. We'll work on an approach I like to call implying the invisible 2-5. We'll take a look at a West Montgomery style approach. Employ the minor 7 flat 5 arpeggio in a variety of ways over a Coltrane style minor blues. We'll explore some interesting applications for triads over a 12 bar jazz blues progression. And finally, we'll focus on the combination of chord tones with intervals to build a melodic theme. I'll perform every piece and then I'll break it down for you, pointing out each technique you need to know. And of course, you also have all the standard notation, tab, and rhythm tracks to work with as well. So grab your guitar, let's get started. Mm -hmm. 